Hi, hello everyone. Welcome to Money Text Guru. In this video, we are going to learn about one of my favorite subject, Knit Fabric Structure Analysis. Since for Knit Fabric Structure Analysis, we need to have a fundamental knowledge. So I have started the video series with single jersey structure. We might have seen n number of knit structures in our day to day life, but all those structures were made using only these three camps, knit cam, tuck cam and miss cam. Just by playing with these three camps, the, all the knit structures were being made. Before we start our analysis, there is a thumb rule. The thumb rule is actually as mentioned in this image, we need to draw a vertical line before we start our analysis. Just we need to keep the courses clean by unraveling the loose ends and after that we need to draw a vertical line this vertical lines vertical line makes the your knit fabric structure structure analysis the perfect one so now we have unraveled the loose ends and we have drawn the vertical line as well so now we are going to start the knit fabric structure analysis it's a magnified view of a single jersey fabric and we are unraveling the course number one. What we are seeing here is the knit loop. The complete loop is getting unraveled from the previously knitted loop. This, this particular structure is called as knit loop. We are going to consider only the knit loops, I mean the loops which is getting unraveled after the vertical line that we have drawn as a thumb rule in this structure from the course one after this vertical line what we have found is all knit structure so it needs to be notified with the proper notations my suggestion is to keep the notations very simple with for a knit structure uh, we can mark it as K and for a tuck structure we can mark it as T and for the miss structure we can mark it as M. So for the course one what we have unraveled is all knit structure. So I have marked it as K K K K. So now we are going to unravel the course number two. Even in this course two what we are seeing is the complete the knit loop is getting unraveled. So even the course number two is K, 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 K. So now we are going to unravel the course number three. After this vertical line, we can see the only the knit loops is getting unraveled. So it is simple. We can mark the course number three as well as K, 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 K. I mean, knit, 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 knit. So let's start the unraveling the course number four. Even the course number four is with the all knit structures. You can see the complete loop is getting unraveled from the previously knitted loop. This is knit loop. So for a single jersey fabric, you know, it's a plain, plain structure with all knit structure. All the courses will be with only the knit structure. So this, so we call it as a single jersey. This is the fundamental study for the knit structure is over with this video. So while studying the single tuck PQ or double tuck PQ or honeycomb PQ, we can come to know the combination of knit and tuck structures. And with the, some textures, we can come, we can learn about knit knit and tuck combination, knit and miss combination. Sometimes in a single course, we can come to know knit, tuck and miss combinations as well in the upcoming videos. Hope this video is very useful and informative. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe the channel. See you all in the next video. Till then, bye from your Money Text Group. Bye-bye.